What's unique about Kobrini as an instructor um, is definitely his knowledge of jiu-jitsu. He, he's definitely willing to put the time to each one of his students and, and he, he puts that extra effort in which, which helps motivate everybody. So it's, it's, um, it's unique to any instructor I've ever had before and it's, it's, it's really been a pleasure. I feel like I'm a part of something really special here. Cobrinha is, is different because uh, it's, a, it's, it's very difficult. You, you found one very good professor and very good competitor. I'm coming to training with Cobrinha because uh, for me Cobrinha is like a mirror, you know. His focus is, is the same focus like me. I always like love to train with Cobrinha. He's like, you know, pretty technical. Excellent teacher. I know him since I'm like 15 years old. You know, and you know, every time that I got the chance to have that change for me is awesome. You know, because he's, you know, a jiu-jitsu mastermind. His 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 work is different because he he knows about the the, the all the new new news positions because he competes all, uh, every year. He, he he make the specific training for all the positions, no old positions uh, still, but the, the, the all the situations with new positions and old positions. Just his style is so dynamic, you know, his jiu-jitsu is so dynamic, but as a person too, he's just, um, he's just such a, such a caring guy, he really cares, he's always on us to come in and drill extra, and it's, you know, um, he's, he's in it for the right reasons, and he's just, he's all about his students, and he, he says he gets more nervous for us when we're fighting than he gets himself. So, you know, that just shows how invested he is. Corbinia's, Corbinia's style is just, it's amazing. I've always been interested in the whole, like, Spider Guard, Daily Heva, and back, you know, when I lived in Arizona, I played it all the time. But when I came out here, man, like, all the details, everything, man, he's, this guy's a great instructor, and his style just matches mine, man. Like, it's, yeah, this place is right for me. You know, I, I've had other opportunities to go to different places, um, but, Overall, you know, I chose this place and it's been the best decision of my life so far. You know, Cabrina, actually, I came here for the camp just for a try, the World's Camp of last year. And, you know, I didn't really think anything of it. I didn't really, you know, watch a lot of YouTube or anything like that. But when I came here, um, he really just, like, you know, looked at me and he really wanted to, you know, see me learn. And I really enjoyed it. And just the way he flows with everything he does and he's just a perfectionist at everything, every move, you know, every technique he does, and I, I want to be like that too. March 29th through April 1st, the choice is yours. Because this year, enjoying the Pan Jiu-Jitsu Championships from the comfort of home is a fully redesigned experience. For the first time in history, every fight will stream, all in brilliant HD. You choose the map that you want to watch. Discover a new way to submit to Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. Visit budovideos.com slash online and ibjjf.org to learn more about this revolutionary interactive event. The 2012 Pan Jiu-Jitsu Championships. Jiu-Jitsu Enhanced. If I had a ghost, I would have to his chest and all the Jiu-Jitsu cut my shin on his shin and push his leg to the side. Man, training has been unreal. Um, we've got a good group of guys and every day we're coming in uh, at nine o'clock and we drill for three hours and then drill from nine to 12 and then from 12 to three, it's competition training. And then nighttime, it's eight to like 10.30. So every day we're just cranking it out, working really hard. The trainer has been really well. We have been uh, training a lot with, uh, with those guys coming from the camp and uh, we are very happy. Cobrinha is pretty much the, the, the type of, of teacher that tells you, you know, may this be good for your game. So only like watching you training, you haven't even tried that move yet, but he knows that that move is going to be perfect for you, for maybe your biotype, for your kind of game, you know. Cobrinha has us working really hard, a lot of roles. The, you know, we're still doing technique and positions, very detailed positions that he thinks that are going to really help us in our game. The training for the Pans has gone really good. Uh, Cobrini has pushed us really hard. 
lucky. Um, I've, ne I've never trained like this for a jiu-jitsu tournament. I'm very excited to go and uh, apply uh, what, what I've learned. We, do we don't change much. Uh, we maintain the training. And uh, for the camp, we, what we do, we just accelerate a little bit, just pushing a little bit more, more sparring. But normally we do a lot of drills and a specific train, but when you come like one week or two weeks before the Pan Ams, and we just do more sparring. Uh, we, we do a lot of uh, specific training, like specific drills, and I, I really like it. And he teaches us how to just go in there and go. Just go in there and 100% start out at 100% and go. And um, you know, I really uh, enjoy that a lot. And it really helps because you really feel it. You feel it you know, in your heart and in your jiu-jitsu, you're just going the full time. I mean, number one, I do want to go out and, and have a good performance, you know, show, show a good game, but um, I'd be lying if I told you uh, I want anything else but gold. I really want to take the gold medal home um, in my weight class, and I really want to also push to possibly uh, get a gold in the absolute as well. I got second last year. I think I'm so much better. I switch teams. I train harder. I, I have a better mental, mental game, and hopefully I can uh, close it out with my teammate now. I feel really good. I feel really confident this time, and uh, I'm, you know, I live jujitsu. I don't go to school. I, I this is my life. So when I go there, it's going to be 150 percent for sure. My goals are the best, you know. Uh, as last year, trying to get the the Pan Am Championship again. You no, know, that's God's plan. Perfect. If not, it may be like I'm not ready yet, but I feel more than ready. I got faith. Uh, we've been training hard. I feel good in training here. So I'm, I'm really pretty confident, and, I, and uh, you know, regardless of the results, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be pretty proud and pretty happy. I'll tell them to go over there and have fun. Don't put a pressure on themselves. They don't have to prove anything to me. They have to prove to themselves, and uh, just have fun. It has to be fun. If you, if it, the thing is enjoyable, always you can do it with love. If it's not enjoyable, sorry, you can't do it anymore. The expectation always is high, right? But uh, I think uh, we have been training here for one year, and I think my students they are going to do well. And uh, and for me, I, I for sure I will do my best, and I'm sure I'm going to do really well too. I have been um, I have been competing on my whole life, you know, since I started in Capoeira. My my whole life is about in a competition, and uh, it's, it's it is in my blood. And uh, I'm being competing at the Pan Ams. And at the world, I'll be at uh, full force.